Good morning. Good morning. Welcome to Monday. Jim, good morning, sir. Today is very much a Monday morning. Thank you, sir. Um, David, good morning. Paul, good morning. It has been a uh, it has been a stereotypical Monday around here. Just things not working, emails and calendars and air conditioning. And, uh, you just name it. It's, things are just glad that my phone didn't blow up yet. If you see it start smoking, or you see me start smoking or something, you know that it's it's gotten really bad. Um, Welcome to Monday. Hope you all had a fantastic weekend. I had a great weekend. I was not here. It's not what made it a great weekend. Uh, because when I'm here on the weekends, I'm teaching. So that's always a good thing for me. <clears throat> so that's what I like doing. I don't know if it's always a great thing for my students having to listen to me talk so much. But retiring every day is Saturday except for Sunday. <laughs> I like that. I'm ready to retire. I'm I'm ready for a week full of Saturdays. We'll do. I'm fine with six Saturdays. We can have one Sunday. In there. That's fine. Um, no, I had a great weekend. I got out of town for the weekend with one of my boys and a couple of buddies and uh, went out to Harmon, Missouri and did some racing on bicycles. And it was fantastically good time. Super painful and and uh, exhausting, but rewarding. And good time was had by all. Nobody, well, I was going to say nobody crashed, but actually one of my boys did crash. Well, the one who rode with me crashed. Um, nothing major, though. Um, we had a great weekend here of training, all sorts of cool classes going on uh, to include uh, attack triage uh, we had on Sunday, had yesterday. Um, get with Rob again here shortly and get some more of those put on the calendar. I don't think we have any other future dates right now, but we'll get some more on the calendar uh, a couple months out. And if, if you, you heard me say it before, I'm sorry, but it's worth repeating all the time. It's super important class to have. Medical training is, is of the utmost importance and um, you need to do it. Jordan. Good morning, sir. Um, and then May 10th, which is two days from now, 7 to 9 p.m., uh, women's only self-defense workshop just down the road from us at Gracie Baja. It's only $25. I don't know. I meant to look this morning to see how many spots we had left in it. I know there's still plenty. We'll say there's 10-ish or so uh, spots left in it. Um, please, if you yourself are a lady, or you have a lady friend that um, uh, has any interest whatsoever in self-defense, they should come take this. It's two hours long, and it's $25, okay? Um, so this is down just down the road from us uh, by Schnooks, if you're familiar with the Ballman area. Um, it's a jiu-jitsu gym that I go to. Great people in there, great training. So please come out and join us Um down there on Wednesday the 10th from 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. You pay when you get there. It's $25. It is, you're getting way more than $25 worth of value. Um, you don't have to sign up. We're asking people to email us and let us know that, hey, I'm interested in coming. We'll send you a, a Google form so you can fill it out. And uh, it's just so that we can keep track of how many people we have coming. Uh, I, I mean, it's a good problem to have if 60 people show up there. That would be awesome, uh, but it would be like, holy crap. So if you're interested in coming, shoot us an email, training at the ring, .com. We'll just send you a link to a form you fill out, and it, uh, again, just lets us keep track of how many people we've got coming. We're trying to cap it at 40. I think we've got around 25 or 30 people signed up right now, um, which is awesome. I just hope that if there's 25 people signed up, that 25 people show up. Um, it's going to be a great time. So please pass the word this Wednesday, uh, 7 to 9 p.m. Gracie Baja, 25 bucks, two hours. Bring athletic clothing, you know, whatever you mind. Or don't mind getting a little sweaty in because it's going 
It's going to be physically exhausting, uh, but it will be a fantastic learning opportunity um, and a fantastic time. Maybe get to punch me in the face. Jim, good freaking morning to you too, sir. <coughs> Damn, excuse me. Andy, good morning, sir. I saw my favorite colored uh, Forerunner was back up <coughs> on the lot. I thought you guys sold it. I was kind of happy that I wasn't seeing it. Uh, oh, I see it back up there again. I don't like that I like it so much. Um, 25% off of, I'm going to do this right now just so I don't forget about it later because I keep forgetting about doing this. 25% off of high speed gear. So we've still got lots of great stuff in here. If you've never used their pistol tacos or rifle tacos, they are fantastic. Um, whether you just want to throw them on a regular belt or on a, on a duty belt, we should have options for you. Some of them are uh, like this particular one here is Molly only, but you'll see some, this one will work for belt or Molly. That one's Molly. Molly. It looks like we have a lot of Molly stuff. This would work on a belt if you want. But we've got options uh, for those tacos. We've got some uh, medical pouches and uh, battle belts, all sorts of cool stuff. General purpose pouches. So And plate carriers. So the HSGI plate carriers, 25% off as well. That's a heck of a deal on a great plate carrier. So come out, check that stuff out. Whoa, I almost forgot my call. Can't do that. All right, let's go wander around and uh, take a look at what we got going on in here. It's very, Dan and I were just talking about how strange it is to be back in here after not being here for two days. Because um, he was off for the weekend and I was off for the weekend. Um, and actually, I was gone Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So it's very strange walking in and seeing different inventory. So. Let's take a look and see what we got. On the, well, you know what? I haven't done consignment stuff in a while. So we got some consignment rifles down here and shotguns. Uh, Thompson Center, bolt gun up here in 308. Remington 1100, Ruger American 450, uh, Ruger 1022, Savage BSA. Marlin, 1894 CS. I don't know what this is. If this is 38. Yeah, 357. So, shoot 357 or 38 special. We've got a standard DP-12, Stag 15, Caltech CMR 30, a New Haven 410 bolt gun, and a Hatfield uh, 20 gauge semi-auto. Now for the new stuff, I've got some Mossberg 500s, 590s, and 930s. One Mossberg SA20. Standard manufacturing DP12. New one. Remington 870 TAC and a Mossberg 590 FDE shotgun. All right, let's take a look at the long guns. Lots and lots and lots of options up here on the long guns. Uh, obviously, mostly 5.56. Five, uh, I've got a lot of 5.56 five, guns from Smith, uh, Rise. Man, we have a lot of Smith & Wesson. Rock River, IWI. I have Galil and Zion. Daniel Defense. Couple of Daniels up here. Man, these are just, I'm a big fan of their rails and their mounting systems. Tammy, good morning. I really like them. Um, couple of FNs. Oh, we do still have the, man, I can't believe this thing's still here. Members only special, a, uh, Wilson Combat AR with a SIG Tango one to six LPBO. Up top, so the member only deal, $19.99.99. FN, so we got some 308 stuff here. FN Scar, SIG uh, 308, Daniel Defense 308, and a CMMG in 308. 
couple more Desert Tech MDXs. So we got another uh, 556 MDX. This one's still in 556. We had a 308, but it lasted like 15 minutes. So I've got two 556 Desert Tech MDRXs, a couple of SIG crosses. I think they're both on oh no, a one in 308 and one in 65 Creedmoor. Uh, Tavor X95, FNPS90, Springfield Hellion. And then I've got some CMMG pistols, uh, both Descents and Banshees up here in 556, 9 mil, 762 by 39. And I think that's about it. Daniel Defense, 556 pistol. So lots of cool stuff. Up there on the wall. Man, we got some we got some MCXs over here too. Holy crap. We have all sorts of MDX options. So uh looks like all I know, so three hundred black. These bottom three are in three hundred blackout. Then we've got a seven six two by thirty nine spear and a five five six spear. We go from the SIG MCXs to high points in 9mm and 45 ACP. And then some more 7.62x39 uh, options. Century, Visca, CMMG, Banshee, and some, some Zestava rifles. Grand Power 9mm, Kalishnikov 9mm, and a couple of complete lowers over there. As always, if you have questions, just blurt them out. I'll do my best to answer if I can. All right, into the pistol case. Shadow systems. I've got DR920s, DR920Ps, MR920s, and CR920s. We're hoping here soon to see the CR920P, which is the, the compensated shadow systems mini pistol. Subcompact, not really mini. Uh, Springfield XDM Elites and Hellcats, Hellcat Pros, and Prodigies. 4.25 and 5 inch Prodigies. Smith and Wesson, a ton of different variants here. Equalizers, Shields, Shield Pluses, EZ Shields, 380 EZs, uh, CSX, MP 2.0s. Uh, SD9s, lots and lots of options. Six hour, I've got lots of 365 and 320s. AXG carry, so if you want the uh, all metal gun. I've got some 229s and 226s as well. 320X compact. 320X carry legion. Very cool pistol there. So all sorts of options from SIG. Beretta, several 92 variants, and APXs and PX4. HK VP9s. And CZ P10C. FN, I've got 509 T's, C's, and mids, and FNX 45 tacks, some with dots, some without. Canic, TP9 and Matei variants, SFX's, Combat, Combat Elites, SFX's, SFT's, and Rivals. And an SFX Pro. Glock. Glock case is filled up a little bit here, but I've got uh, lots of options. 21s, 42s, 48, 17, 19, 19X, 34. We've got a Gen 1 Repop. Had one of these, sold it pretty quick. Got another one. Uh, let's see. A couple of MOS guns. 
47 and 19 MOSs. Walther, I've got Q4 and Q5. PDP, PDPF, PPK, PPQ, Gearson MC9, SAR9, and Bursa Thunder and BP9s. Ruger 5.7, Max, American, Security, and EC9s and LCPs. Taurus G3s and 4s. And some Airx, Delta, L, M, X, and Zero. So the cases are pretty full right now, which is a, it's a good thing. So come out and check out what we got. All right, in the use case. I've got 509C, M&P Shield, 320X Compact, Ruger LCP, Smith Bodyguard, Car P9, Glock 48, Ruger 5.7, another Shield, and a couple of M&Ps, one 2.0 and one non 2.0. Taurus GX4, Ruger LC9, and Ruger EC9. Another one of these things that you should check every time you come in is take a peek at that uh, use case just to see if anything that strikes your fancy. All right. Head back over here to my perch. Talk about a couple things and then let you guys get back to your regularly scheduled lives. Gordon, good morning, sir. Oh, we've got Silent Night coming back. So we haven't done one of these in a while. But we've got one coming up on May 10th as well, same as our ladies uh, punch fill in the face day. We'll talk more about that in a second. But Silent Night... So, uh, Mark Cox will be coming out, I believe, to most, if not all of these. To answer, If you don't know Mark, he is a, a local attorney who does NFA trusts um, and can answer your questions about pros and cons of, of doing trust versus not doing a trust. Um, even though he does them, he's very upfront and says that, you know, you might not want to do it for these reasons, but you might want to do it for these reasons. I chose to do one. Um Jake will be in there, I believe, uh, uh, answering questions, talking about kind of the, the process of, of how to buy, you know, as far as when you come in here um, and how easy it is. And you're going to go downstairs and you're going to shoot and get to try, test some stuff out. So we're going to try to do them on a more regular basis. So our first one, not really our first one, but the first one in a, in a little while is this Wednesday, May 10th. Okay, so then we got June 21st, July 12th. And August 9th. So get signed up and come out and shoot some quiet stuff. So everybody's welcome to that. Same night, we have our hand to hand class with uh, a women's self defense class down the road at Gracie Baja. Women only for that one, but it's only 25 bucks. So um, for two hours, 7 to 9 p.m., and uh, get to learn how to use um, leverage and physics to uh, give yourself an opportunity to get the heck away from somebody, right? It's not to sit there and it's not to learn how to, to break arms and break noses and whatever. It's to, to give you time to get away. All right, so um, it's going to be full of a lot of great information. I'll be out there. Liz will be out there. Who knows? Vinny might be out there. Um, so it could be a punch Phil in the face and choke Vinny out or something. Day. I don't know. I don't know if Vinny will be out there or not. But um, come out. Check it out. Please. It's going to be a great time. If you're interested in going to this, Shoot us an email, training at the range stl.com. We'll send you a link to sign up. You, you don't pay us. You pay Gracie. You'll pay the, the day of the class. Um, 
it's going to be a fantastic time. I know there's seats still open in it. I don't remember how many. I believe 10. We're, tra- we're eliminated to 40. Um, do you have to sign up to show up? Nope. Do I really care if 50 people just walk in the door? Nope. Would I rather be able to warn them about that? Yep. <laughs> um, I don't think we'll get to that many. I hope we do, but help me get there. Right. We're, this is, we're not making any money on this. And trust me, it's, it's really not a, a money maker for them either. This is, this is, this is about information and making people understand that there's things you can do to give yourself opportunities. Wish you all were closer. Just, it's, we're worth the drive. Do it. Do it. Or the flight. <laughs> we're worth the flight too. Um, Members, uh, so this month, members get free targets when you come out to shoot. They can get one free target each day. So come out, shoot your gun, take advantage of that. Um, all sorts of rebates. I'm not going to go over all the rebates right now. There's all sorts of rebates from all sorts of different manufacturers. So if you're thinking about picking up something, let's see if there was a sheet sitting around somewhere. You know, let's, let's, let's just see. You're thinking about picking up something? Yeah, here we go. Maybe this will push you over the edge. But all sorts of rebates from Sig, Taurus, Savage, Beretta, Keltec, Diamondback, Winchester, Browning, and Crimson Trace. So just one more good excuse to uh, come out here and get something cool. Uh, all sorts of great classes going on right now. We've got CCW happening right now. Um, bunch of stuff coming up. I, this will be maybe even my only day on this week. Maybe Thursday I'll get on. I've got class, uh, Tuesday and Wednesday morning. So you all miss me. I'm sorry. I apologize in advance. All right. That's all I've got for today. So unless you guys have any comments, questions, or concerns, I'm going to let you get back to your regularly scheduled Monday morning. I hope you guys have a fantastic day. I don't know. It's kind of crappy looking outside right now. I don't know if it's supposed to stay that way or if it's supposed to get nice today, but I hope you get outside. And if it is going to be nice, get out of your office buildings, get out of your house, go outside and do something. All right. Um, you guys have a fantastic day today. If you need something, you know where to find us, 14803 Manchester Road um, in beautiful downtown Baldwin. Come hang out and get a cup of coffee and a new SIG MCX. Sounds like a good plan to me. You guys stay safe, be nice to one another, and we'll catch you soon. Later.